Meanwhile, back in the Cooley region, it's tough to find a cloud in the sky. Let's bring in meteorologist Bill Grawl for a look at the Cooley region and a check on the tropics. Bill? Yeah, much uh, different weather around here. And some good news with Idalia. It's now back down to a tropical storm, still a powerful tropical storm, 70 mile per hour winds. And it's riding uh, right along the coast of the uh, Georgia and the Carolinas and still kind of a heavy rain threat now. Six plus inches of rain possible in parts of South and North Carolina before it kind of turns uh, back out to sea. But uh, boy, a powerful category three as it came on shore early this morning, 125 mile per hour winds. So that is uh, one of the stronger storms ever on record for the Big Bend area of Florida. So it's no wonder they saw some significant impacts. Clear skies around here, boy, a beautiful day. 78 was the high, 54 the low, slightly below those averages of 81 and 60. 97, the record high not too long ago, that was in 2012. Rain continues to be an issue, no rain today. 2.39 inches below average for the month. 4.71 inches below average for precip for 2023. Pair of 78s for the airport and downtown. Lots of sunshine. Winds out of the northeast at 6 and the Mississippi holding steady 5.04 feet. Eau Claire, sunny for you as well. 76 degrees, north wind at 5 to 10. And again, very comfortable humidity values with very low dew points. So a little bit warmer, in fact, quite a bit warmer off to the west. 80s and 90s there, uh, but comfortable 70s in our neck of the woods. Still 76 in Eau Claire and Black River Falls. 77 in Winona, still at that high of 78 in La Crosse and 75 in Viroqua. Look at how dry these dew points are for August. Yeah, when you have dew points in the 30s and 40s, like just to our east, that is some very dry and comfortable air, although it really dries the uh, vegetation out even more as well with the drought conditions in play. And it's going to be another very comfortable night with low humidity dew points in the upper 40s to lower 50s. Winds not overly strong from the northeast at about 5 to 10. Again, cloudless sky all across the upper Midwest, and that's thanks to high pressure, and that's going to keep us dry and clear tonight and lots of sunshine for our Thursday. Sky Tracker will show the clear skies tonight. Winds shift to the southeast, but they'll be light. Tomorrow, those winds pick up a little bit from the south-southeast with a mainly sunny sky. A few passing clouds tomorrow night. Even some showers over far northern Wisconsin, but our neck of the woods does look to remain dry uh, right through Friday and into the holiday weekend. Highs tomorrow, touch warmer than today, right around 82 degrees in the La Crosse area. Most spots will see highs between about 77 and 82 degrees. And uh, to be honest, that's right on track for this time of year to wrap up the month of August. Again, that full super moon tonight, clear and comfortable. Another windows open night. Tomorrow, 82, lots of sunshine. Breezy and warmer Friday to welcome in September 88. Here comes that heat wave, mid to upper 90. Saturday, right through Tuesday and dry until a slight chance of showers and thunderstorms, especially later Tuesday and better chances Tuesday night. Small chance of storms lingering into Wednesday and dry next Thursday with highs slipping back into the 80s. But boy, it's going to be a hot holiday weekend. Yeah, sure looks like it. Bill, thanks very much.